<laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Cody Rhodes. Luger Rhodes. Oh my god. Cody Rhodes. Cody Luger Rhodes. Or should I say Cucky Luger Rhodes. Or Cucky Rhodes. Has been cucked by The Rock. Wow. It looks like... <laughs> Damn. You got cucked, bro. You got cucked. <laughs> you got cucked, Cody. <laughs> oh my god. Perm. Okay, so, Smackdown last night. Wow, Cody Rhodes, bro. You were dumb. <laughs> you got cucked, you dumb motherfucker. <laughs> you got cucked, bro. Wow. Cody Rhodes has officially become Cucky Rhodes. And it looks like the Rock and Roman Rings is most is most likely gonna happen at WrestleMania 40. Good. I'm glad that's happening at WrestleMania 40. That right there, that right there is a WrestleMania match, not Cody Rhodes versus Roman Reigns. Get the fuck out of here. Also, this makes the Royal Rumble more fucking meaningless, more fucking pointless. Holy shit. Wow, Cody Rhodes just gives off his butt. To the rock? Yeah. Like, go show that. No one, no one, not even HHH, aka Triple H himself, can say no to the rock. <laughs> no one can say no to the rock. No one. <laughs> wow. Hell, not even in WB when the, when the rock asked Henry Cavill, when the rock asked WB to bring Henry Cavill back as Superman, the rock said no for an answer, man. Like said, man, The Rock says no, man. The Rock's the head of TKO. No one says no to the goddamn Rock. No one. <laughs> yes, Rock and Roman. Shit, there. Looks like we don't have to wait next year. Oh, thank God. Holy shit. Bye bye, Cody Rhodes. And some people are like, oh, but Cody Rhodes needs to finish the story. Fuck the story. Fuck the story. The story ended last year. There is no story anymore. Fuck the story. The story is dead. Cody Rhodes never finished his story. He almost like he'd come back to AEW so that, so that way he can stop the egomaniac Tony Khan. But then again, so maybe Cody Rhodes can at least get rid of Rampage and Collision. But then again, I have a feeling if Cody Rhodes comes to AEW, maybe in months they'll probably be. Maybe in, in a couple of months, AEW will once again be lame and boring. <laughs> boring and oh god, he might bring her. Apparently, she, I think she might be a feminist, just like Stephanie McMahon, but I think Brandon Rhodes, oh god, no. Might also come back there as well, god, no, please, we don't need Brandon feminist for Stephanie McMahon, 2.0 black Stephanie McMahon, Brandon Rhodes, no, no, fuck Brandon Rhodes, man. Fuck Brandon Rhodes, Brandon Rhodes sucks. But if she, if she is truly a feminist, just like Stephanie McMahon, oh boy, she even sucks more. <laughs> but yes, um, let's see, but. Yeah, man, Cody, Rock and Roman, man, absolutely. And now all of a sudden, these people, apparently I read the comments, now people are saying, now these people are saying, oh, this is a disgrace, this is terrible. Nah, WWE doesn't cater to smarks, remarks, like, or these big effect. And most of these people, some are fucking Indians, most of these people are saying these are mostly Indians, fucking anime fanboys, fangirls. These fucking gay-ass anime boys, lesbian anime fangirls. <laughs> stop it, just stop. A WWE without Vince McMahon, they still don't cater. So maybe the only good thing that trip, well, well, one of the few good things, one of the few good things that Triple H has done, maybe he only did that because he can't, because The Rock can't take no for an answer. Triple H got cut. <laughs> ha ha, Triple H. So you don't want Triple H to agree with that. So maybe, maybe a good. Thing, a, trip, a good thing that Triple H has done. <laughs> wow, Cody Rhodes just gave all this spot to The Rock. Hell, even with The Rock, <laughs> Cody Rhodes look fucking. Cody Rhodes fucking shake the hand. The Rock's hug. Co Cody Rhodes hug. And the, all of a sudden, Cody Rhodes looks disappointed, bro. He looks like he's about to cry, bro. That's fucking embarrassing. That's why Cody Rhodes should not have won the Rumble, man. The Rock should have won the. I don't even know why The Rock was in the Rumble. The Rock should have won the Rumble. God damn it. But oh well, The Rock is. <laughs> the Rock's gonna challenge from rings anyways. Good. No, The Rock is not going to fight at Roman Reigns. I think that should not be fucking stupid. I'm sorry, Grim, Grim from Grim's Toy Show. You're an idiot if you think. And I, no, I like you, Grim. I do. And I'm glad you lost weight and all that. And, you know, I still watch your videos and all that. You're great now, but I'm sorry. That, that's the shit. 
Apparently Grim, and, uh, even though it was days ago, but his dumb ass thought that the Rock and Roman should have any Shiver, no, fuck no. And same thing with JD from NY. No, JD, stop. Stop. And, but now he doesn't think that anymore. But now, <laughs> no, even JD hates it. I'm sorry, JD. No, you're becoming mid, JD. I'm sorry. You're literally the king star of the IWC. But probably worse. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. And it's Solo Monster. I think Solo Monster gives that. This gives this I think good Mike Wordick also this. I'm sorry, good Mike Wordick. You have to, I'm sorry, dude, you're cool. You sound like a cool guy now, but you have zero reactions. And you're, you should stop doing last year reactions. You have zero reactions. You have no reaction at all. You should just You should just do live stream reviews and that's it. Stop live streaming reactions, bro. You're not good. You're not good at live streaming reactions, bro. You have no reactions at all. At least I'm a fucking good reaction videos. Even though I have somewhat reaction, but somewhat reaction, but that doesn't mean. At least I don't do live stream reaction videos. Because I, I don't know, it's like 50-50, I do have reactions, I sometimes don't. So, I sometimes don't, so at least I say myself. But god damn, bro. Some people are pissed. Man, people are fucking pissed. And these are the same people that wanted The Rock versus Roman. Now, all of a sudden, they don't. Now, they still want. Now, they want this fucking Roman and Cody. Like, fuck out of here. Fuck the story, man. And what about... Man, what is Cody Rose gonna do now? Now, he's gonna fight Seth Rollins for the... The WWE World Heavy Championship, aka the mid-card-looking ass... WWE World Heavy Champion? That, I'm sorry, that World Heavy title looks like a mid-card belt, I'm sorry. Now, I did say it did look good, but... It looks it looks good, but... I also did say that it looked like a mid-card title, but guess what? It, it does look like a mid-card title. <laughs> it does. It, it, it looks like a good mid-card title, literally. It's literally number two belt. Wow, Cody was gonna go for that title. <laughs> wow, that's fucking... <laughs> Man, at, at this point, Cody might, might as well go back to AEW. At least stop from Tony Khan, Koresh Khan, whatever. <laughs> Beta Khan, emo Khan, bitch. Luger Rhodes, Lex Luger, Cody Rhodes, man, that's what Cody Rhodes is. He's basically Lex Luger 2.0, but fucking worse than Lex Luger. Man. Hell, even worse, way worse than John Cena and Hulk Hogan, but at least Cena and Hogan are way better. And at least Lex Luger's way, at least Lex Luger's way more, way more believable than fucking Cody Rhodes. I'm sorry, man. Cody Rhodes, WWE doesn't cater to evil. Smart fans, evil bitches. Smart and Mark fans. No, WWE. No. Thank God for that. Thank God someone says people in those fucking comments on the walk in. Man, people were racial, racial. Man, those fucking racial boo dislikes are most likely anime bots. They're fucking bots, most likely. No, it's gay ass bots. Good. Good, I'm glad Rock and Roman. The comments are a bunch of hypocrites. These are the same people that wanted to rock and Roman. Now, all of a sudden, they don't because they want Roman and Cody. Fuck out of here. Fuck Roman and Cody. You want the same match repeated last year? No. Fuck no. I don't know. Will Cody fight Roman Reigns? I don't know, man. I don't know. Personally, I don't think if Cody Rose winning the money in the bank, that would be stupid. I'm sorry. That would make Cody Rose look like a loser. That would make Cody Rose look like a cheater. Oh, wait, not, not a cheater. That may, wait, I mean, I don't mind. But I don't think that fits Cody Rose's character, unless if he turns heel, maybe. But I mean, I don't, well, I don't mind cheating wrestling, but. um. Let's see. That that make Cody Rhodes look weak. That he just basically beat Roman Reigns when he literally just fought a wrestling match. Will he fight in SummerSlam? Maybe I don't know. I mean, eh, whatever. At, at this point, nah. At this point, Cody Rhodes. Or maybe he'll fight next year's WrestleMania. I did. Say, I think I did. Say, Roman Reigns and Cody Rhodes could have in WrestleMania for the one. Yeah, maybe. Oh God, but, but please tell me they're not gonna have Cody Rhodes with the Royal Rumble for a third time in a row. That'd be fucking stupid. No, stop. Maybe he can win the Olympic Championship next year. I don't know. Maybe they'll do Cody and Roman next year. I mean, maybe they could do that. Maybe I don't know. I don't know. I just, or at this point, Cody Rose just goes to AEW. Like I said, he could he could stop Tony Khan from his egomaniac booking. So, and maybe he can cancel Rampage and Collision. Good. Because he should just cancel those Collision shows. Even though I still watch Collision DVR, but I'm watching like past episodes and. That YouTube and I don't watch Rampage anymore. I don't have that shit in DVR because I'm done with Rampage. Rampage is garbage. Collision, on the other hand, Collision is mid as fuck. It's forgettable as fuck. It's mid. Mid Lucian. Dynamite, on the other hand. I don't know. Dynamite is like 50 50. Like sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad. I don't know. It's like 50 50. But yeah, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. I'm glad, man. I'm glad. Roman Reigns. Man, I'm starting to gain respect for The Rock now. I'm starting to gain respect for The Rock. That's good, man. That's fucking good. Because I've been hating on The Rock. Like, oh my god, whatever game, Rock and Roman, man. Um, 
and all that. And The Rock made a wordless Mac to return it. Fucking, he had no business with that stupid jobber idiot Austin Theory. Um, but yeah. But then again, I mean, he buried Austin Theory. Which, eh, Austin Theory sucks anyways. He's he's literally a dollar short Alex Riley. So Alex Riley has more is more charismatic than piece of shit um, Austin Theory. Um, uh, let me see. Yeah, man, Rock and Roman, man. Absolutely, WrestleMania worthy match right there. A dream match indeed. I wait, wait, wait. Dream match. I mean, more like a modern dream match. <laughs> Like, like a super duper dream match will be Haku versus Roman Reigns, but then again, Haku's old as fuck, so yeah, that would not work. Um, but yeah, but this is but but modern dream match, what? Yeah, yeah, I, I would say tomorrow, absolutely, this definitely say modern dream match because, because of course, the Rock has been around. So the Rock has been around. Also, the PG era, the modern era. The Rock's also been around the modern era as part time, obviously, but. He had Roman Reigns disrupting the modern era, aka the PG era, aka apparently they call this the new era. <laughs> uh, this new era is the new era. So yeah, don't know if they're gonna ever change the name of the of the era name change. Uh, like I said, BC Amplified calls this the mutual respect era. <laughs> Talking with me, hell, you, BC Amplified is right, man. BC Amplified said that the Rock and Roman show at WrestleMania. So congrats to BC Amplified, man. BC Amplified knows what's up. Let's see who. Uh, yeah, man, I just rock, rock and Roman WrestleMania 40, absolutely. And then there's some people saying, oh, but the Rock looks gassed. Oh my God, dude, he looks gassed now. Promo Legend. Oh, first of all, it's just a promo. It is not a fucking wrestling. He didn't wrestle Jinder Mahal, you dumbass. He was just cutting a promo. It doesn't mean he's gonna look gassed. Guys, go against Roman Reigns. At least he wasn't gassed. I like CM Punk was fucking. I'm sorry, I keep it real. I like CM Punk, no, but I, I, I'm starting to think he's. Old. CM Punk's kind of overrated, I'm sorry, and especially those fucking comments people are like saying that, oh, Cody was right, CM Punk, CM Punk is dead, but yet yeah, CM Punk's fucking, I'm sorry, keep it around, CM Punk's a fucking hypocrite, I mean, the dude's still in WWE, the dude's in WWE now, if CM Punk stayed true to his word, stay true to his words, and he could've, I don't know, maybe if stupid Tony Khan didn't fucking fire him, or maybe CM Punk could've gone to TNA, maybe, <laughs> But apparently CM Punk got fucking injured. And keep it real, CM Punk is fragile as fuck, man. He is fragile as fuck. But yeah, but I'm glad that CM Punk, I mean CM Punk, that Rock and Roman's gonna happen to WrestleMania 40. Thank goodness. Thank that that's best for business. Not Cody and Roman again. Stop it. Stop it. Now sure, maybe the Rock, Rock and Roman, yes. Rock and Roman could be predictable. Actually, it is gonna be predictable, but... We need to make it unpredictable, where people think that The Rock's gonna win, but in reality, Psych Roman wins. But yeah, but like, Rock beats the shit out of Roman Reigns, and The Rock rock bottom people's elbow and all that. Yeah, we, we need to make it up. We need to, like, swerve the fans, like, just like how we swerve them with, oh, the Cody Rhodes stand, they're gonna cry, oh, what's mad, Cody fans? What's mad, like, anime gay boys, anime fans? Yeah, most of these Cody stands are, like, anime fan boys, and anime fan girls, like, uh, gay ass, lesbian ass girls. <laughs> oh, God, y'all bitches. Most of these fans are, like, evil Bitches, man. It's because Cody Rose was not was a fucking anime relevant show in Netflix, along with Kenny Omega as well, which, yeah, which is weird. <laughs> and of course, Cody Rose cosplays the All Might slash Homelander, even though Homelander's not an anime character, but the All Might is uh, from My Hero Academia, but yeah. See, uh, Cody Rose is basically, he's basically trying to be like Luger 2.0. <laughs> My god, but worse, worse than Luger, man. That's why he called him Cookie Luger Rhodes. Cucky Luger Rhodes has been cucked by The Rock. Wow. No one says no to The Rock. No one. Just like The Rock to WB as well when. And apparently The Rock's reason by Henry Cavill was back in Black Adam and W. Uh, Henry Cavill was back as Superman in Black Adam and W. Because The Rock told WB for that. So that's great. So that's great. And of course WB had to ruin it. Uh, fucking James Gunn to recast fucking Henry Cavill with David Carson, which I don't mind. I'll admit. It's a good cast. It, you know. A great casting, you know, for a younger Henry Cavill. But I'm still mixed on Superman Legacy. Uh, God, there's but when, uh, you know, there's too many a lot of heroes. But let's see, there's too many a lot of heroes. But let's see. But to be honest, let's talk. But to be honest, we're talking about Rock and Roman, so we're not gonna talk about any comic stuff yet. Any comic stuff, maybe till till uh, till any new <sighs> till other videos. So yeah, sorry, sorry guys, sorry. Um, but yeah, but yeah. Um, yeah, Rock, Rock and Roman, absolutely. WrestleMania 40. 
Absolutely. Yes. Yes, but I don't think the Rock should take the title. I think that'd be. I think that'd be worst. Um, I think that'd be. I think that'd be terrible. However, if the, however, the Rock, uh, King Mike, King Mike's World, pitched that if the Rock would, because he thinks that the Rock should win, or if the Rock wins, the Roman Reigns should go ballistic. Holy, Roman Reigns should destroy, destroy everybody. I'm sorry, I don't care. Roman Reigns should also kick the, should also beat the bitch out of Samantha Irby. <laughs> Why the fuck not? But that's not gonna happen. Oh, that does happen. Roman Reigns will get suspended from now. Makes Roman Reigns more predictable. Roman Reigns beats the bitch out of Michael Cole and all the commentators. He should beat Samantha Therapy as well. Come on. Or, or, or whoever. He should. He should beat the ref. He should beat the female refs and the referees. That would be of course, referees and bodyguards would come in. And say, but if that happens, but I don't think that's gonna happen. I think Rock or Roman's gonna retain against Rock, and and they're gonna have Roman Reigns break Hulk Hogan's record. So, yeah, man. So, yeah, remember the, the Rock and Roman. Yes, yes. That right there is WrestleMania moment, not Cody and Roman. Stop it. I don't know what they're going to do with Cody Rhodes. Maybe he'll, he'll fight Seth Rollins, I guess. Or maybe he's not even going to be at Wrestle. Or maybe he's not even going to fight for a championship at all. Wow. That, that's just. <laughs> So Cody Rhodes is going to pull a, a fucking hex out Jim Duggan and Big John Stud. <laughs> yeah, because I don't think those two, they won the Rumble, but they didn't even fuck for championships. Wow. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh, he's going to pull Lex Luger. He's going to pull Lex Luger because I don't, I don't think Lex Luger fought. I don't think Lex Luger fought for a championship, or maybe he did, but. I mean, I don't think Lex Luger fought for a championship. Or, I don't know. I can't remember. Or maybe he did, but I think he lost. I think Lex Luger lost. Dude, he's pulling a Luger, man. That's why I call him Luger Rhodes. Cucky Luger Rhodes, or Kobe Luger Rhodes. Luger 2.0, but at least Luger was, at least Luger was, you know, physically better. And Luger looks like you could be the shit of, Lex Luger in his prime looks like you could be the shit of Cody Rhodes, but, yeah, man, that's what Cody Rhodes trying to be. He's trying to be like Luger 2.0, bro. And y'all people say, man, also the people are comparing Hogan to Bret Hart. How do that's a terrible comparison because there's a difference. Bret Hart was fucking, fucking Mr. Fuji, fucking Mr. Bret Hart. Bret Hart was fucking Mr. Of course, Bret Hart would ask Hulk Hogan to beat Yokozuna for him because Bret Hart was Mr. Use. Bret Hart would not have beaten Yokozuna. Yokozuna would have squashed his ass. Yokozuna would easily grab him and squash his dumb ass. So of course he's gonna ask Hulk Hogan for help and yeah, Hulk beats Yokozuna and. And of course he would send the championship, but yes. So of course Bret Hart would ask Hulk Hogan for help because there's no way in hell Bret Hart, a misted Bret Hart would beat a blinded Bret Hart would beat Yokozuna. No. So that that's a terrible comparison. I'm sorry. So yeah, some people Oh I'm sorry, comparing Bret Hart to Cody Cody Rose like that, that's stupid. I'm sorry. Bret Hart would beat the bitch out of Cody Rose, huh? Yeah, Hulk Hogan would knock the bitch out of Cody Rose. John Cena would beat the bitch out of Cody Rose. Yeah, but yeah, some people are saying that CM Punk, oh my god, he's right. Oh, Dwayne, he's stealing, it sucks that, you know, and this is a quote from 2011. Oh, Dwayne, the rock, John, Dwayne is going to main WrestleMania, it makes me sick that he's going to main WrestleMania, but not me. Bro, CM Punk, in 2011, you, bro, he lost to Randy Orton in WrestleMania in 27, and you lost to Randy Orton in WrestleMania 27, and bro, you were, in 2011, you were kind of rogue. Ah. Uh, now, yes, yeah, that was the year where people started cheating for Cena Punk and all that, but keep it real. I think this was before he won the WWE Championship. But I'm sorry, Cena Punk. Bro, you were just a mid Carter. <laughs> before you know, you 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 know, before you became WWE Champion, fighting John Cena and all that shit. And that, and and I'm sorry if he's. Still, and I'm sorry, Cena Punk is still in WWE, <laughs> and he's still not doing shit about it. Right now, he's fucking injured. He's fragile as fuck. John Moxley was right about CM Punk, fragile ego, fragile mind, a fragile body. And I'll admit, the, the Rock's ego can also be a lot crazier, I'll admit that. But at least I agree on the Rock's ego in this one. <laughs> Just weird, really fucking weird. Weird, but this makes sense. Absolutely, Rock and Roman makes a WrestleMania money match. Not. So say, I'm sorry, Jay, for a minute, why Rock and... Roman and Cody is trash. Mr. 206. Oh, but Rock Rock does not need to be WrestleMania. WrestleMania's already sold out. Yeah, but it needs to be sold out more so that way more people can come in. So they need to... So, 
Of course, it's WrestleMania, but it needs to sell out more so that way they can announce more freaking matches. And since Rocky Roll, now more people are going to come into WrestleMania. Now more people are going to come in. But of course, JD, you want to. You want that fucking. Sorry, JD from the White Tools. You're fucking mid, bro. You're mid. And I used to love you, mate. I used to like you. I don't see the love for love. That's, that sounds gay, but. Um. Uh, I used to like it, man, but now you're just becoming dumb, bro. Dude, you're becoming way worse than fucking Keemstar. That's fucking embarrassing. Dude, you're literally the Keemstar of the IWC with the Dr. Disrespect thing. Sorry. So, yeah, and hell, even some of the JD's fans, oh my gosh, JD's fans are fucking stupid, bro. They're basically like the WWE fan of the comments, WWE's comments, the fucking marks. It's fucking smarks. Fucking, of course, caring for fucking wrestlers. Fucking jobber ass wrestlers. <laughs> These fucking beta fact wrestlers. <laughs> like they care about all that. Yeah, these fucking wrestlers are Dave Ruth. Just fucking let's see like Austin Theory. Fuck Austin Theory, man. Austin Theory is trash. And then Grace Grace and Waller's fucking mid. Dominic. Dominic Mr. is fucking garbage. Well, I know JD's so care shit about Dominic Mr. which I don't blame him. Um but there's some but I bet there's some people in the comments depression Dom Mr. Fuck that Dom Mr. is garbage. He's literally a dollar for Billy Kidman, the worst. The worst. At least Billy Kidman's way fucking better. And David Flair and Eric Watts are way better than a uh, fucking uh Dominic Stewart was bitch ass. Um But yeah, man. <laughs> Rock and Roman. Oh yeah, the JD McDonough, that's a trash ass wrestler. Chad Gable, Chad Gable's mid as fuck. He's literally a dollar for Kurt Angle and Kent Thera. But fuck, oh god. Worse. He's a poor man version of Kurt Angle and Kent Thera. Um, and he got Otis. Otis looks like a skinny, looks like a fat ass Kent Thera. <laughs> god. God, man. Akira does something, man. They mean Akira's all a joke. At least our truth Our truths still awesome, man. Our truth is awesome. Damon Priest is kind of mid. I'm sorry to make it come. Same with Finn Balor. I'm so fucking mad. But y'all people praise the most beta fag wrestlers ever. Like, man, you got Sammy Zayn, which. I don't know, I mean, okay, I'll admit I do. I'll admit I was good. Oh, Sammy Zayn, Kevin Owens. I know it's good. I'll admit. I actually. I'll admit. I actually like them. I don't mind them, but I'll admit they're kind of over. They're kind of overrated. And then same with Logan Paul. Fucking Logan Paul's overrated. But y'all. Man, y'all people will. I like to cheer for the most beta fag wrestlers ever. Like, I'm sorry. But yeah, but I'm sorry in process about. You know, Sami Zayn, Kevin Owens, man. Well, I don't mind Logan Paul. Logan Paul's a good... Logan Paul's a good... Logan Paul's a great... Logan Paul's a great wrestler, I'll admit that, but... But I'm starting to... Uh, try to cross this. I mean... But I, I don't know, I just do... But I do think he's... I do think he's kind of overrated, but yeah. Oh, especially since... You know, you know what, I won't talk about his personal business, but... Yeah, you know, the, the freaking Christmas scam and all that, but you know what, we're not going to talk about that, but yes, Rock and Roman is a WrestleMania money match, we're finally doing it, finally, after years, but at the Rock said the long game, this has been a long game already, this has already been the long game, the Rock, this has already been the long game, it's been a long game since 2020, slash 2021, we've been asking this for 2020, well, not 2020, uh, but of course, we were teasing it for 2020 for the um, WrestleMania of 2021 and 2021. Then the WrestleMania 2022, which and then WrestleMania 20, 2023, which is last year WrestleMania, and then, and now the finals gonna happen this year. Haha, <laughs> Cody Rhodes got cut. <laughs> Goodbye, Cody. Oh my goodness, man! I love it. 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 All right, who else? Okay, I don't even know why I'm talking about. Okay. No. I don't know, I, I don't know, I just don't know these, these fucking Smarks, man. These Smarks, Smarks. Let me see, Seth Rollins. Uh, I'm sorry, Seth Rollins. Uh, okay, I'll admit I actually like Seth Rollins and all, but I'm sorry, his title looks fucking mid. I mean, his title looks like a fucking mid-card title. That War Heavy title looks like a mid-card title. I'm sorry, it looks fucking kind of small. Yeah, compared to the original War Heavy title. But, yeah, man, just, oh, gosh. Yeah, but, you know, and of course you gotta, you know what, let's just focus on Roman and Cody, I mean, Roman, Cody, Roman and Rock, but yes, man, Roman and Rock, Roman and Rock, absolutely, we're finally getting the match that we wanted, but of course now people are like, no, I want Roman and Cody back, no, Cody deserves to be, fuck the story, what's the story, 
finishing his death. Like, I'm sorry, keeping it real, Dusty Rhodes is overrated as fuck. And his brother Goldust. At least, I'll admit, Goldust, I'll admit, he's underrated. But then again, he kind of did, 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 he did say that he wanted Cody Rhodes to win. Sorry, Cody Rhodes, you know, to fight The Rock. Well, guess what, Odie? Stay triggered. The Rock's in fight Roman Reigns, I mean, not your brother. Yeah, he won. He wanted his brother Cody to fight Roman or something. Well, that's not gonna happen. Haha. <laughs> Sorry, go D or Odie. But at least you made the smart decision of not coming to AWWE. At least you're in AW, so AW, so that's good for that. So what's Cody Rhodes gonna do now? I mean, some people want Cody Rhodes versus Okada. Which, first of all, Okada and the No thanks. I'm sorry, but Cody Rhodes Okada. That's not a WrestleMania match. I'm sorry, that is not a WrestleMania level match. That's fucking. I'm sorry, no. Two overrated wrestlers. No thanks. I'm sorry, but Okada's overrated ass is going to AEW. <laughs> and Cody Rhodes, uh, he might come back maybe around the end of the year. I don't know. <laughs> Cody Rhodes got cucked, ladies and gentlemen. He got cucked. <laughs> Cucky Rhodes. And yet, this is the man that you want to the throne Roman Reigns. Yeah, no. I prefer Braun Breaker to the throne Roman Reigns. Braun Breaker would be great. So, yeah, man. But let's see, let's see what happens. But, yeah. But anyways... Rock and Roman possibly having WrestleMania 40. I'm down. Come on, man. We should have this for years. We should have that match for like years ago, WrestleMania. Or, like either 2022 or 2023. We're finally going to get it. Finally. And y'all people saying, oh, no. Man, some people are saying, oh, I'm losing respect for the Rock. Oh, no. He's, we want Cody to finish. Oh, this is the big disgrace. Uh, shut up. Shut up. Rock deserves this moment. The Rock deserves this moment to fight with his cousin Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns also deserves this moment. It's time for Roman Reigns to become the tribal god. If he defeats The Rock, The Rock's Roman Reigns is completed. I'm sorry, but fuck Cody's story. Roman Reigns de defeating The Rock's way more important than Cody's story. At least Roman Reigns has a story. His story is to finish The Rock. His is to defeat the Rock so that we can become the tribal god. I think that's what Roman Reigns gonna call himself, because Roman Reigns keeps saying, you know, "I'm in God mode now." So guess what? Now he's gonna be the tribal god. I think that's what they're gonna call. Him. I think that's where that that's what they might call Roman Reigns, the tribal god. But yeah, but Rock and Roman, WrestleMania 40, fuck yeah, let's do it. And Cody Rhodes, ha ha, he got cucked. Cucky Luger Rhodes has been cucked. Take your L, boy. Take your L. But anyways, that's it, man. Rock and roll or something. Holy fuck yeah. Anyways, see you guys later. Peace. That's all. That's all.